हेलो एवरी वन हेयर इज अ क्वेश्चन ऑफ एस क्यू एल वे आर सम रिलेशन इज गिवन एंड वी हैव टू सॉल्व फॉर द एस क्यू एल क्यूरीज नाउ आई ऑलवेज सजेस्ट टू द स्टूडेंट्स वेन एवर देर इज अ क्वेश्चन ऑफ एस क्यू एल फर्स्ट क्रिएटेड डमी टेबल सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल इन दिस वी हैव गिवन अ टेबल ऑफ एम्प्लॉई सो वट आई कैन डू इज आई कैन क्रिएट अ टेबल एम्प्लॉई इट विल टेक Uh, two or three minutes to create a table and enter some of the dummy data, but it will help you get the desired result. So it has employee name, street and city. So what I will do is I am uh, I will come back with the complete table structure. So suppose we have created this dummy uh, tables employee works company and manages. Now see, first query is find name of employees who works for F S B I. So from works relation, I can find out that there are two employees A and C who works for S B I. So simply we will write here. Select E M P name from works. where company name is equals to sbi so the output will be output here will be a and c <coughs> in the second query i have to find the name and cities of residents of all employee who works for sbi now see there are two employees working for sbi so uh, i have to find the cities of these two employees a and c and the cities can be find from this relation employee so so my answer will be a delhi and then c also delhi so my answer should be like this so to get the desired result what i need i need to know the name of employees who works for sbi which i can get from this works relation so write it like this same query which you have written earlier select emp name from works where company name is equals to sbi now find the name of employees and city who works for sbi so you can use the concept of nested query so write here like this select emp name comma city from employee where emp name in then this query select employee name from works where so uh, the output of this inner query will be a comma c and then this select employee name comma city from employee where employee name in a comma c so there will be two results only a and c if the city delhi then you have to find for find all employees who don't work for sbi so the same query works just you have to write it like this uh, i can get only the employee names so select emp name from works where company name is not equals to sbi so this is how you can solve the sql queries thank you for watching the video please subscribe to the youtube channel for more Uh, such questions and tutorials thank you